Hey there, Hunters! Hollow Hunter here with another TCG opening for you guys. That's right, I'm back. Kind of. Uh, for one video, at least. I said to you guys that I didn't have a lot of time to make a lot of videos. I also said that things were getting a bit expensive, and all that is true. It was very expensive to be collecting Pokemon cards all the time, and trying to get all the videos up as quickly as possible. But, you know... I really wanted to do something special because I also said that if they made a Mimikyu GX, I'd be back. And I am back because that is exactly what happened. And I know I'm late to the game. It took me a while to get my box. But here it is. I got a box. A Fairy Rise. Ooh, really excited to open this up. And I figured if I'm only going to be back every now and then, you know, not as regularly as some of the people that you guys watch, and if I only want to focus on Japanese cards more than I want to focus on English cards, I might as well make the special and do something with some people that I really appreciate and love, and I think that you really appreciate and love. And if you don't know them, you should definitely be checking them out. So this is going to be a collaboration video with Dorobozaru and Brace Gaming, two of my bestest buddies when it comes to Japanese Pokemon card collection. I am really excited to do this. So what we're going to do is we have each a box of Fairy Rise, and we're going to crack them open, and we're going to try and see who can get a Mimikyu GX first. If you hear some rolling around and stuff in the background, my cat has decided, of course, hey, you're filming, so this would be an excellent time for me to be active for the first time today. So just so you guys know, you're going to see uh, a cat interruption at some point, I'm sure. Or at least hear it. I'm sure you already heard it meow once. But you know what? The show must go on. And the show will go on. Because Mimikyu GX waits for no one. And for no cat. Kitty! Where's your ball? Where is it? There it is. Let me throw this ball for you. Get it. There we go. Cool. She's got her ball. We have our cards. Got Mimikyu here. We got Mimikyu related stuff. And I got my... Lovely Mimikyu sleeves that I got from that really special box that I had in Japan a few months back. So this is for if we get the Mimikyu, Mimikyu GX. And we got these other sleeves for all the other cards. Not to say they're not special, not to say they're not awesome, but we're here for the Mimikyu. So the way we're going to do this collaboration, I think I've already said it, but just to be sure if I did. Uh, first person to get the Mimikyu GX wins our little battle. And it doesn't matter how long it takes you to get it, if you get the Hyper Rare Mimikyu GX, you're a winner anyway. I mean, come on. That's amazing. But in this battle, that Ninetales GX means nothing. Nothing! But I'll still be very excited if that's what we pull. So, uh, just know that my excitement will be there, but uh, it means nothing for this video. Because <laughs> this is all about that Mimikyu. Uh, now let me be tender with this box, because I only have one. Ooh, new box. Dumb. So how's everybody been? Let me know in the comments below. Have you uh, been enjoying the way the Pokemon TCG's been going? I honestly don't know much about it. I haven't been able to keep track. I've been really, really busy with some other ventures uh, in the daily life. Um, yeah, life's been interesting. Life's been weird. It's been fun, too. But I've taken on a lot of projects here in town. And it's keeping me on my toes. And unfortunately, keeping me a little bit away from YouTube. But hey, it also keeps me really happy and energized. Let's put this box here in the background. There you go. There's that kitty flame with all the noisy things. <laughs> the moment that I'm trying to make this video. Oh well, like I said, we wait for no cat. So let's kick this off. Again, hello everybody. And let me know in the comments how you've been, uh, how you've been doing. Um, you got any good decks going on? Is there anything you're looking forward to? I know I'm looking forward to SM8. I know it just came out and I'm really looking forward to getting my hands on a box of that. Because Lugia GX, Suicune GX, the two boxes I wanted back to back. Yes, please. Uh, so yeah, our first pack. Here we go. It's been a while for me. I remember that the pack trick was one to the front. And if I get names wrong, sorry, it's been a long time for me, guys. I don't really know what to expect here when it comes to trainers or Pokemon necessarily. Um, and some of them I probably just don't even know. I do know this was a Kapagurgus. And, okay, see, so here we go. Uh, some new Pokemon. Uh, Shinotic, I believe, is this one. We got a Tangela. Cutie Fly. And see this guy, uh, Morty, right? Morty was his name, which, you know what? 
Originally, I was going to do some sort of a really cool, spooky video about this, because Mimikyu is a ghost Pokemon, and I know it's a fairy set, but Morty I thought was really fitting for Mimikyu as a ghost. You know what? I don't normally do this, but uh, I'm having troubles with these packs, so uh, we're going to do it everybody else style, and cut them open, and hope and pray that I don't cut any cards. But, you know, I'm the odd one out. I tend to do them by hand, but now we're going to cut them open. Did I leave a card in there? I did not. Good. That's also why I don't cut them open. Ooh, I think we got something special on this one. So this, I believe, is the fairy charm? Looks like a fighting charm, actually. Uh, mm, mm-hmm, you, ninja ask, I guess? I don't, whatever turns into Cofagrigus. Uh, a cicada-looking thing. <laughs> we got a Morlull, and we got, ooh, that lovely-looking chandelier hollow. We got the Huntress uh, skulking about, trying to see what's going on over here. Say hello to everybody. Go on. Say hello. Hello. My goodness. <laughs> My weirdo girlfriend, everybody. Okay, so they turned this way. I will figure this out as we go along. I believe this was a net ball. Not a nest ball, right? It's a net ball. Got a Trico. An adventurous pouch, I think is what that was. Oh, this is a Cascoon. I actually would not have known this, but I know it now because I just evolved a worm pole in Pokemon Go. I was like, what is that? And it's a Cascoon, so now I know what that is. Yay! And we have a Rebombi. Oh god, I feel like I'm slower with cutting them open than I was normally, but you know, it's also the way I have to do it. I want to like show you that I'm cutting it open, but we'll, we'll get this to work, you know? Um, yeah. Let me get my stride here, guys. I haven't cut open packs in a long time. I, haven't, oh, I have not opened a Pokemon card since the last video you've seen me in. No lie. Trico turns into that thing. I forget what Trico actually turns into. I'm so sorry. The thing in between Trico and Sceptile. Got a Litwick. What's up you, Litwick? Carbank. Nice fairy type there. Fitting for the set. <laughs> There's a Wormpole. And, ooh, Tapu Finny. Looking lovely. I hope this auto uh, focus is working out because I'm not used to working with that either. But I'm doing this with my phone. Because I got a new phone, everybody. Got a nice new phone. And it films in 4K. And I wanted to test it out. So if this is wonky and it's not focusing and stuff, don't worry. Uh, well, I say you'll see it. It's on. So we're doing it anyway. But hey, I believe this is Ninjask, actually. Uh, oh, look at that Vulpix. Lovely. I know you guys have seen this already because you guys have been around looking at videos the whole time. Did Dene? Uh, this was mm, that queen thing. Uh, mm, I should know this one. The, the queen bee. And I've used this in a deck before. Do you remember the name? Vespa Quinn. Thank you. Because it's a wasp bee and I hate them. Ah, this would be a, like a psychic charm. Okay, so there's like a fighting charm, fairy charm, psychic charm. Okay, there's got a charm for everything, don't they? Okay. How uh, charming this set is. <laughs> oh my lord. Would you believe that my activities have all been comedy based? Yeah. Yeah, thanks, cat. Beauty fly. <laughs> Cutie fly. Tangela. Got a Trico, I think. No, that's not Trico. This is, uh, mm, mm, Kecleon. And, ooh, we got our first ultra rare here with a. I, got, I count it as an ultra rare. But we got a Xerneas Prism Star. That is beautiful. Ooh. Loving that one. In fact, you get a sleeve. I know I didn't sleeve the hollows. I will later. But I figured these thicker sleeves should be reserved for these nice, lovely cards right here. All right, we're still going. We have not got a Mimikyu yet. And I have not counted the packs. We'll count the... I have the packs over the side, so we will count those once the Mimikyu is hit so we can have a definitive uh, answer as to who got that first. All right, we got a Mina. Now, this is a full art I would not mind getting, but let's be honest, I want that Mimikyu GX as a full art. But Mina is really cool. I wouldn't mind having her as a full art. Curlia. Oh, God. Mm, mm-hmm. You? Yes. Yes. Sure. B thing. Uh, <laughs> we got a Ralts. And we got a Meloetta. I didn't even know Meloetta was in this set. Interesting. Is Meloetta fairy type, you guys? Or is it just psychic type? I think it might just be psychic type. So it's such a weird angle for me. I, like, everything about this setup is different. I'm just sitting at my dinner table. Actually, this is the way I used to do the setups when we first started the channel before we got the desk. 
So it's kind of weird and funny and cool to be back this way. But I figured, you know, I don't have a setup anymore. So, in Tengro. So let's just, you know, let's just set it up real quick and do a nice fun video. And, oh, they got a Gardevoir because, you know, not enough of those exist. I'm sure everybody has said that with every video that has ever been made with this, this set, but man, I would be so happy if that was the end of it now. No more Gardevoir cards, please. Then again, I mean, I'm a Mewtwo guy, so I'm sure everybody feels the same way about Mewtwo, but at least make Gardevoir look remotely different in the cards, if you could, please. Ankeda, Genotic, and uh, a badge of some kind. Told you, I don't really know the trainer names. Sorry about that. I mean, I know the supporters, but for the rest, didn't really look the rest of it up, because, like I said, I'm here for the Mimikyus, and uh, I'll recognize that. I'll recognize that just fine. <laughs> I don't know why I'm being so weird. It's late. That's also a testament to, like, I've been busy. You know, I'm still busy. Ooh, you need to have Lampant, another Satchel, another Carbink, a uh, Dragon Charm. Oh, that was a Dragon Charm. Cool. So no real uh, ultra rares so far. No uh, GXs at least. We do have one Prism Star so far, but uh, can we get like one of those four GX boxes? That'd be nice. Probably just gonna get the three. Another Morty. Tease than us with these supporters. Trico again. You. <laughs> um, Bright Vespa Quinn. Ha. Ah. Ooh, Shaman! And it's the Hollow Huntress's favorite version of Shaman. It's the Hedgehog Shaman. Yay, and very cute Shaman. I gotta say, that's a really... That's one of those hollows that's so pretty that you're just happy to have it. Even though you, you kind of... When you buy one of these boxes, you know you're gonna get a, at least one of them. But it's like, ah, you may not be super rare. Or rare. Or rare rare. But you are uh, pretty. And that's what matters. Fighting Charm. Litwick. Warmful. Have we just gone through all the normal cards so far? Alolan Vulpix, Coffer Gigas, that was that. I think we have. If we haven't, then we'll, we'll get a couple surprises, but all in all, I think we've uh, done that. All right. Sorry if there was a dip there. I was just checking to see if everything was still recording. The screens were turning off, making me a little nervous that everything's still recording, so we're good. So we got our Ribombi here, Cascoon, Kecleon. Rolts and ooh, <gasps> oh yes, Alola Nine Tails GX. It's not any of the really super valuable ones, but it's still pretty, pretty freaking valuable. Um, valuable enough that this makes the box kind of not fully paid for, but worth it. I mean, this is not something you're guaranteed. This is not a GX you're guaranteed. So, ooh, really happy with it. But you're not a mimic you. You're keeping me from winning my competition or contest, whatever you want to call it. Ah! Oh. We got a man down, dude! Oh. Battle. Battle. Winning the battle. Knowing it's half the battle. And uh, so is not knocking over the camera. <laughs> there was another edit there, because the camera went down. But yeah, it's keeping me from winning this battle. But it's still an Alola Ninetales GX, so can't complain too much, now can I? And a beauty fly. First half of the box, we're at the last pack here. I hope everything's still in focus for you guys. Um, one GX. Just one GX. So this other side here better have quite a bit of stuff, or this better be a Mimikyu right now. Please let it be a hyper rare Mimikyu. Make me happy. I see something shiny, so it could be a GX. Could possibly just be a hollow. Let's see what we got here. Got that Trico, got that Jigglypuff, and got a hollow, but we got a really awesome one. We got that Giratina. Oh, goodness. They nailed this artwork. Oh, fantastic. All right. First half down. Nothing in the way of Mimikyu's. But we still have our Super Rare floating around as well. So our full art is somewhere around here, and it could be a Hyper Rare. One thing I don't want it to be is a gold card, and that happens to me more often than I would like it to happen. Um, no gold cards, please. <laughs> please, no gold cards. Amina, which I would not mind. Tangela. Shinotic. Thing. 
and another Tapu Fini, which is odd. Two of those already. We're getting doubles in the hollows, and I don't even have all the hollows yet. I don't even have a Tapu Lele yet. And I know it's in here. I feel, and maybe I'm the only one who feels this way, I feel they should have put a holographic Mimikyu and a Mimikyu GX in this. Because this is a very special celebration of Mimikyu. But I could be a little biased in regards to Mimikyu. So, uh, yeah, give me a And another Rabombi. Ooh, got a Lola Ninetales GX. I'm gonna sing out a tone, I'm so happy. Yeah. I'm like the white member of Boys to Men. I was a boy and now I'm a man. But I'm a man who opens up Pokemon cards on TV. Yeah. Hope you enjoyed that little serenade. <laughs> I'm just, I'm being shamed in the corner. Curlia and another Giratina. What is this with the doubles? What is this? I, yeah. I am perturbed as well, Cat. I am perturbed as well. Kitty is upset because she was just in the bedroom and now she's not in the bedroom anymore. And she's not allowed to go back in. Yeah. The life of a cat is so hard. I can tell you now, I, I guarantee you I've lost this battle. <laughs> There's just no way uh, I'm going to get a Mimikyu GX in time. I bet you they've already gotten one on the other side. But you know what? It's fine. It's fine, Brace. It's fine, Duel Rosado. You guys go ahead and win this battle. But I win because I got to collaborate with you guys. You're awesome. And if you don't know how awesome they are... Really check out their channels. The links to their channels will be in the description below. I have a hard time believing that anybody who's watching this video doesn't know them, but uh, yeah, go 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 help help them. You'll be helping me, but helping out my buddies. They do far more active content. Yay! There it is, Mimic UGX. Ding 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 ding. It's not one of the super rares yet, so we still have a super rare coming up. But oh, it's so pretty. I'm so happy, you're so pretty, you're so good. Ooh. Okay, let's put it down, let's get the sleeve out. It's the first time I've ever opened these Mimikyu sleeves. Figured this was a special event. The fitting, a special sleeve. Oh, this is my little friendly friend, my friendly friend. Hello, there you go, you all sleeve friend. Look at my boy or girl or whatever. I mean, pink doesn't have to be a girl. Oh, that's so cute. So good. And it's little Mimikyu sleeve. Oh, yeah. Love that the two GXs have gotten so far. Some of the best. Um, let's quickly count our... Actually, no, let's just go through it. I will make another stack of packs for the remaining packs we got here. Um, and I'll probably just do that off camera so you guys don't have to sit through me uh, counting things. <gasps> we got the Mimikyu! Awesome. Back to what I was saying, though. Uh, please check them out. They're my friends. They're like my little friend over there. Um, far more active, and they're always into Japanese cards. I mean, Dora Rosado actually lives in Japan. So, yeah, she gets her hands on those pretty quickly. Braish is really quick to get his hands on stuff as well. He usually collaborates with Plaza Japan, which is a fantastic place to get your cards. This is where I got these cards. No, I was not sponsored. Yes, I have been sponsored by them before. That does not matter. What matters is... Oh, ho, ho! Full Art Supporter! We got Morty. I had hoped it would have been a Mina uh, or a Mimikyu, but I will take Morty. I think Morty is the more popular of the cards as well. Goodness, look at the... Man, look at the texture on that. Oh, I love how like the little flames and stuff in the background just kind of swirl. Gotta say, not a card I really cared about, but they always do this to me. I'll be like, eh, I don't really care, and then as soon as I get it, I'm like, that is amazing! Woo! Okay, got that Morty. <sighs> anyway, yes, Plaza Japan. Great hookup for things like this. Uh, I was unable to get SM8 through Plaza Japan because honestly, I did not know it was arriving so quickly. I lost track of everything. So, yeah. Um, that was on me. They're totally sold out of SM8. <laughs> but I'll try to get my hands on that some other way. So you guys will see me back for that one. I have a carnivore. Sorry, Gardevoir fans, but no, we're not paying attention to that one. Um, but yeah, if you are in the EU, or just out of Japan in general, UK as well, of course, Plaza Japan's a great place to get your cards. It really is. 
check them out while you're checking out Brace Gaming and Orbitals Auto. I'm very curious who got the Mimikyu GX before I did, but I'm so happy I got one because you were not guaranteed stuff like that in these boxes. I could have been without a Mimikyu. In fact, I would love to double up on the Mimikyu GX. That would be great. I'm a little bummed I didn't get either the Full Art or the Hyper Rare because now I have to hunt those down and buy them separately, but maybe that's going to be cheaper than getting boxes and trying to find them, you know? Uh, but I definitely need those for my Mimikyu collection. Um, that, that's how I'm going to be doing collections, by the way. I'll buy a box of a set I'm really excited for, like the upcoming, well, like the current SM8 set. You know, Lugi GX, been waiting for that one. Suicune GX, I am so freaking pumped and stoked for that one. About as excited as I was for, I'm getting my, I'm getting my packs to each other. About as excited as I was for Mimikyu GX. So, yeah. I'm... I'm all in for that one. If I can get a Suicune GX that way, fantastic. If not, I'll buy it, you know? But I'm not going to be just spending hundreds and hundreds on... And there's the... There's the top of Lele. Beautiful, too. Beautiful. Uh, but I'm not going to be spending hundreds and hundreds on Pokemon cards. Unfortunately for you guys, and for me as well, I loved being here. I love doing my thing. But... Just can't, I can't afford to do it all the time. But do keep your eyes on this channel. Please don't run away and think, well, he's never there, so I'm going to unsubscribe. If you please just stick around. I've, I've loved the support. And uh, when I posted on Twitter that I was doing this video, I got a lot of support, and it was a really nice feeling. I love to see that people really liked the videos, and they're happy to see me around. And I'm happy to do videos. So I'll do them when I can. It's not going to be very often. You know, as you see, months apart from each other. But when I can, I will, and sometimes I might even do some bigger, flashier videos as I learn to deal with uh, things like, oh goodness, what's going on here? Uh, things like Photoshop and stuff, which I Photoshop, I keep using that, Premiere, I want to say, Adobe Premiere. So I'm not gone, I'm just not here, or I'm here, but I'm gone, I don't, you know what I mean. I'm not, I'm not gone forever, I will be back, this is not the end. I know the chandelier. So we should have one more GX out of the three remaining packs. There should be one more GX in here somewhere. Otherwise, I got gypped on a 2 week GX box, which is okay considering what we pulled, but would be nice to get that other GX out of this. Ooh, we got the Mimikyu. We got the Ninetales. We got Morty. I don't know how excited I should be for that, but he looks cool. Like, and a, please, please educate me in the uh, comments, guys. What, I mean, I'm going to look it up, <laughs> so I'm going to know, but go ahead. Yell at me, educate me. What comes in between Trico and Sceptile? I'd love to know that one. Is it Grovile? Is it the name? It's Grovile, isn't it? I bet you I just found out the name myself while I'm talking to you guys. But you know what? Eh. These are Japanese cards. I don't have the names on them, so I can't cheat like all the people who do English cards. Not, <laughs> I know all the Pokemon. <laughs> it's amazing. Now you're reading a card. I have to remember things. Haha, -ha, memory. Boom! Last GX is a Sigalith GX, which is pretty dope. I kind of like it. I don't really know what the other Pokemon were that you could get. Um, looking at the box art. And the Xerneas is a Prism Star, so I know it's not that. So I'm assuming this was like the only other one there was in the set? I'm sure there's another one. Maybe I prefer to that one. I don't know, but I'm, I'm cool with Sigalith. Sigalith looks cool. It's a cool looking Pokemon, so I'll take it. I'll take it with no complaints. So this last pack is going to have nothing in it, and we will like it. Maybe it has a hollow. Maybe it has that fourth GX that I wanted. That would be fun. All right, last pack. One in the front. I'll try to go through these. So we have Cofagrigus, which is funny. It's how we started us out. We have a Ralts, Cascoon, Morlul, and a patch thing. You had to end it on a note that I didn't recognize. Fantastic. Okay, let's quickly go through the pools, the lovely, lovely pools. Uh, sure, you know, I'll do it in order of value, but we'll, we'll give Mimikyu a lot of attention. <laughs> so here are our lovely pools, apart from the hollows. We got this Xerneas Prism Star, which I think is a cooler Prism Star. I did not want to get the stadium, so I'm happy that we got this one. Got a Sigalith GX. Mimikyu 
GX. Hello, Nine Tails GX. So happy with that. And a Morty Full Art Supporter. Can't go wrong with Full Art Supporter, but it's not a Mimikyu GX. Uh, uh, Mimikyu GX. Put that right there, because that is the card of the day. And I'm going to quickly go through the packs to see how many it took before we got our Mimikyu GX. So there was one... One eternity later. All right, count them up. Um, 19 packs. Took 19 packs before we got the Mimikyu GX. So if either Dota Pizzotto and Braish did not get a Mimikyu GX, I win. And if it was their last pack, I win. If they got it in their first half of the box, Wowie wow did I lose. <laughs> I, I think I would have won if I would have started on the right side of the box. But I decided to start on the left, and I think we I think that's what we're gonna do. I don't know. You'll hear what rules they've decided upon in I don't know, I'm putting this back here, I'll put it here. Uh, in their own videos. So please make sure check out Dodo Bazaro and Brace Gaming's versions of this through a pack battle. And let us know who won, and honestly, you know, I'd say let us know who you think won based on the pulls that we got, because there's no guarantees when it comes to Japanese stuff. That's why I like it so much. It's so much fun to just see what randomness you're going to get from a box. So, I'm really happy. I got a Mimikyu GX. Yay, 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 yay. I got what I wanted from this. I'm really happy to have made a video for you guys to make a little setup like this, and do some pack openings. It's kind of nice to open up some Pokemon cards. So thank you guys so much for watching. Give this a like subscribe for more if you have not done so already like i said i won't be here very often but you will see videos in the future definitely be sure to give dual brazado and brace gaming a subscribe tell them the hollow hunter sent you if you came if you went there from here and until next time i will see you guys on the hunt goodbye back, back, back from the dead.